A judge took just 15 minutes to find an Indianapolis man guilty today of murdering a pastor's wife. Larry Joe Taylor shot Amanda Blackburn to death during a home invasion in 2015. Now, this is the third time this case has gone to trial after two previous mistrials. Thank you for joining us here this afternoon. I'm Nick McGill. And I'm Max Lewis, and I was in the courtroom for this verdict today. I spoke with Blackburn's husband, who says he is now relieved that this nightmare is over. Walking out of the courtroom, Pastor Davey Blackburn, with tears in his eyes, said he was relieved that a nearly seven-year nightmare had come to an end. It's always a relief to know the truth. It's been a long journey for our family. This painful journey for the Blackburn family began on November 10th, 2015, when Larry Taylor, Jalen Watson, and Deano Gordon entered the Blackburn home early in the morning after seeing Davey leave. According to prosecutors, Larry stayed behind while the other two took a bank card and went to steal money from an ATM. Prosecutors stated in court that Larry Taylor shot Amanda twice, once in the head, after he tried to sexually assault her and she fought back. Amanda died two days later. We know that Amanda's with Jesus. And we know none of this is going to bring her back, and so that makes us extremely sad. Watson and Gordon took plea deals and testified against Taylor in exchange for having their murder charges dropped. Watson was sentenced to 29 years in prison. Gordon has yet to be sentenced. The prosecution credited the guilty verdict to the community speaking out. It was a case that was really dependent on our community stepping up and coming into court and testifying about what they saw. Amanda's father said all he has is gratitude in his heart. We're grateful for the verdict. Mm -hmm. um, but we have been trusting in both the Lord and the system. Davey has said in the past he forgives the men involved in his wife's killing and reiterated today that he couldn't get through this without his faith. This entire journey, um, he has the final say on all of it, and uh, we can put our trust and rest in him no matter what happens. Now, as we said at the top, this was the third time this case has gone to trial. At the end of last year, a mistrial was declared after it was accidentally revealed in court that Amanda was pregnant when she was killed. The judge said it would prejudice the jury since Taylor wasn't charged in the fetus's death. During the second trial this year, a mistrial was declared after a member of the jury lied about having any previous knowledge of the case. Attorneys for Larry Taylor told us today they had no comment.